Hello, welcome to the We Teach CS Summit. Our team is so happy that you're here. We can't wait to spend the next couple days together. Our CS for Y'all theme. Um, we look forward to spending time, learning together, and growing together. It was so great to see so many teachers and faces of people that I have known for years that come back to the We Teach CS Summit year after year, but it's even more special to have all of those teachers come that have never been there before, have never heard of We Teach CS, and have an instant connection with us and feel that they belonged. You know, computer science teachers and just computing teachers in general, they come in all shapes and sizes and colors and creeds. It's, it's amazing. The rich tapestry of educators who were present at the conference is something that in my years in CSA, we didn't always see that. And a lot of those faces are new to computing. It was just a beautiful thing to see and I'm, I'm gonna take that with me everywhere I go. It's important to teach cybersecurity in our schools because it's going to help the next generation of learners. So, um, you know, they're going to learn how to secure their devices, how to keep their information safe, um, and that's going to be important as they move forward in this new tech world. It is imperative to teach technology application, to teach CS in its entirety to the students of today because they are the CS of tomorrow. I thought computer science was just coding, to be honest, but I had no idea about cybersecurity, um, networking, um, and just as well as game development. Computer science is a really broad, big field. And, um, Definitely coming to this conference has definitely broadened my horizons as to what else, what else out there. And we decided just to uh, venture out, explore more, so I can bring it back to my students, so they too um, can not just focus not just coding, but also other things as well for future jobs and careers. When we take a look at the data from the OCED, there are a couple of things that it reveals broadly about how we need to train for the AI future. I share this because I think it's really important as we think about the holistic development of students through teaching and learning. The best way that we can impact our communities is have a wide array of students, a wide array of minds and brains thinking about the problems of tomorrow and actually planning the solutions using computing. I am super grateful to VEX and the College Board for sponsoring our We Teach CS Changemaker and Mini Grant Awards. It's so important to recognize our teachers for their accomplishments and all of the efforts that they go to to bring computer science, cybersecurity, computational thinking into their classrooms um, and really expand it and to have them um, be celebrated and recognized for that effort is amazing. Winning the Changemaker Award meant that all of the work I had been doing, uh, especially since I'm a standalone teacher, that all of the work, the prep, the frustrations, everything, it was all worth it, it was noted, it was seen, even though I didn't know it was. You know, as teachers, a lot of times we try to find things on our own, and we don't always find the good stuff. And We Teach CS really helps us find the quality content. They have a, a lot of resources um, that I still go back to from uh, time to time when I'm looking for different lesson plans, when I'm looking to expand um, CS at my school, or just uh, give resources to other uh, teachers in Ohio that I know. But it's definitely a um, benefit. It is definitely a resource that anybody can use, and they are very helpful. They reach out. 
and especially being in a place where we might be the only computer science teacher not only in your building but maybe your district that is definitely another outlet that can help anyone interested in CS. Teachers don't have to be a finished product to teach computer science. It's a work in progress. We often talk about imposter syndrome. A lot of teachers have been teaching computing for years and still feel like they don't know the newest and the best and the, 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 the most timely technologies. But we learn with our students. We learn and we make sure that we're the lead learner in the classroom. We teach CS in the methods of our professional development, really lean into these concepts of you can know this and you can do it. And if teachers really kind of take that opportunity to, to, to give it a chance, then you, you definitely will not be disappointed with the professional development that you get at WTCS. Thank you.